from KTVN Reno. You're watching 2 News at 5.30. I've talked to a lot of people who have uh, really clear recollections of when it happened and where they were when it happened, and it generates a lot of excitement. It's a flashbulb memory. The moon landing 50 years ago was a worldwide event, and to celebrate the anniversary, there are some local activities for people to enjoy. That is tonight's 2 News Big Story at 5.30. Good evening, I'm Ryan Canada. Kristen Remington has the night off. Thanks for keeping it here. Well, few things in human history compare to landing a man on the moon. The historic and scientific significance is undeniable. Brandon Foos joins us now live in the studio. So Brandon, the 50 year anniversary is really a huge reason to celebrate here. You got that right, Ryan. And like you said, it was really a colossal achievement, and that achievement brought new technology and a new sense of adventure to the world. That's why 50 years later, so many people are happy to celebrate it. Oh, yeah, I'm going to do that, actually. The 50th anniversary of the Apollo 11 landing, coupled with all of the excitement about space right now, is the perfect time for people to re-engage with that, that sort of enthusiasm around space exploration. At the Discovery Museum, they went all in for the Apollo 11 anniversary, celebrating all summer. It's a chance to look back at history and see how the idea of space travel is changing. One of the displays we have from Sierra Nevada Corporation is a, a device they call the Veggie. It's actually designed to grow plants in space. Um, which is definitely key to being able to live on another planet. The National Automobile Museum is celebrating this Saturday with activities and guest speakers from NASA, including two people who worked with Apollo 11. They were doing science that had never been done before, figuring out what they needed to do to get the astronauts there, how to keep them protected, how to be able to walk around on the moon. And as a result, NASA actually came up with plenty of ideas that exist today. Heart pumps. Um, food stabilization and baby food, the micro miniaturization of the computer chips. It used to be that computers were huge warehouses and now we hold in our hands more computing power than they use to send the astronauts to the moon. The value of the technological advancements is incredible, but one could argue the historic achievement did just as much for the human spirit. There you go, look at that, oh wow. And it brought people together on Earth in a very special way. It wasn't just the United States landing two guys on the moon, but it was humanity, we landed a man on the moon. Now Saturday's events at the, Na <coughs> excuse me, Saturday's events at the National Automobile Museum kick off at 9.30 a.m. One space exhibit at the Discovery Museum comes down after summer, but that dark room you saw called Under the Stars, that will stay open until next summer due to grant funding. Covering the big story in the studio, Brandon Foose, 2 News.